Sara, Martha. Martha! What's her problem? Is she pregnant or just fat? Stop this now! See what she's wearing? Take a good look at that shawl. She's a dark s- It's a regular pig farm in here. Drop it. Isara! Huh? Hold it right there! Sara, are you okay? I'm okay thanks to you. But Martha, I think she's... Martha! This isn't good. She's gone into labor. <clears throat> Fathers have left us something. Something that might get us out of this mess. Dad's tank! It's one of a kind. Here it is, the Edelweiss. Tamer built it especially for General Gunther. I enrolled in a maintenance class given by the military. I just fitted it with a new turbine engine. It really improves on the power to weight ratio. Its firepower and mobility are more than a match for recent models. Welks, you took the armored vehicle course, didn't you? Yeah. Back in high school, once. We'll bring Martha here. She'll be safe inside the tank and we can move to a better location. Just leave the driving to me, okay? Engaging engine! Alicia could still be out there dodging bullets, buying time for people to evacuate. All right, Edelweiss, move out! There's going to be even more casualties among the townspeople. The town watch will defend this gate so as many people as possible can get away. My turn, okay? Enemy sighted! Enemy unit spotted! Please help! 
keeps up. should be able to breach that wall. It may provide us with a shortcut, Box. All right, let's give it a shot. Hang in there, Alicia. those soldiers enemy tanks sighted Welks switching to anti-tank combat armor piercing shells loaded all right let's go take it down Woohoo! Now you're my hero, Welkin! The Imperials are running off for now. Looks like we bought some time at least. Welks! Welks! It's a boy! Martha had a boy! She... she gave birth in Dad's tank? Yes, and without complications. They're both perfectly healthy. Good! That's fantastic! Now let's stay sharp as we head out of town. Alicia. I thought I would be ready for this. I knew war meant this might happen. Seeing all those people killed, it's just not right. How could all this happen? It isn't human, Welkin. We look at those birds and see how wild and free they are. But they all have their own territories. People are animals, too. We do what we have to, when we have to. Animals are in a constant struggle to stay alive, but I've also seen them help each other, almost like they were cooperating in order to survive. 
that coexistence. I want to know how it works. If we could figure that out, mankind could put it to use for our own survival. That's why I want to be a teacher, so that I can pass that knowledge on to the children. I mean, even if we can't completely eliminate war, at least we might learn to live together as one people. You think so? Welks, look. Oh, he's adorable. Just like you said, even in war, new life happens all around us. Come here. Look, that's your hometown. Someday, we'll come back home again. Someday soon. I know it. <laughs> 